Bradburn, sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. And welcome back, everybody. 6.13 is the time right now. We're looking at 68 degrees in San Angelo. Humidity a bit higher, 93%. And winds are still on the calm side, coming in from the northeast, maybe one or two miles an hour. Got a lot of upper 60s to low 70s across the Contra Valley to start off our morning here. And humidity levels are a lot of 80s and 90s for majority of the region as well. We have a few areas, Sonora and Big Lake at 79%. But still, with those calm winds and the higher humidity, we are looking to have a bit of condensation as we start our day off on our vehicle. Air quality index will be sitting in the good range for this morning. The air is going to kind of feel a bit stale. You know, so it's going to make everything smell a little bit more potent as we start off our morning here, especially, like I said, with those winds kind of being a main factor. If it's not moving anything out, it's just going to be sticking right where it is. Now, the clouds are moving from west to east at this time. We actually have some clouds starting to build up around Coke and Tom Green County at this time. As we continue getting through the rest of our day, we are going to have a little more sunshine for the mid after, or mid morning into the early afternoon hours and then partly cloudy skies later on today. Winds will pick up from the south about 5 to 10 miles per hour at the top of the noon and from the east later this afternoon. Highs are expected to be low to mid 90s as we get through our Tuesday. Now tonight's loads were dropping back to the upper 60s to low 70s. We'll have a few clouds lingering in the sky and then tomorrow we're expecting once again, low to mid-90s for our highs. We'll have a mix of sun and cloud. We could see a few afternoon showers coming in later in the day, and that's going to be widespread across the region. So it's going to be kind of coming in from the northeast, heading in a southwestern direction. It's a little unusual for this area here, but a lot of the showers, like I said, are going to be scattered, similar to what we had yesterday. Very quick showers are going to be happening and if you do need to mow the lawn best opportunity is going to be for thursday friday this week it's going to not be too bad for today and tomorrow but like i said depending on where you live it's going to depend on where you have showers coming in especially in the later afternoon hours by the end of the week, we're looking at plenty of sunshine and temperatures getting closer to the upper 90s. And then Monday of next week, we're going to have a bit of a cooler start, upper 80s to low 90s with a mix of sun and clouds.